Hello everyone, Chief Meteorologist Brian Hale. Everything's coming together, the moisture and energy helping to deliver that chance for showers for the Rio Grande Valley, showers and thunder showers. Good news for us all. Overnight tonight, we expect a chance for showers and thunder showers to continue. Mostly cloudy skies, 74 degrees, bottom out temperature for Harlingen, southeast wind 10 to 15. A couple of things coming together here. Again, moisture and energy in our region and a little extra kick from that storm system making way across the southern plains. It's going to continue to push on through to the east and generate chance for severe weather north of us, but also help tie in to some of the action going on in the mountains of Mexico off to our west. So that's good. It, it, every little bit helps, and that's how this will all unfold through the end of the week. We see, again, the bullseye for rough and tumble weather will stay well north of the valley. We'll be in the general thunderstorm zone there, but nothing exciting expected to happen in terms of severe weather. I think this is all going to be fairly normal garden variety shower and thunderstorm activity. Could see a couple go severe, but again, the heavy-duty rough and tumble stuff will all be north of us. Future cast shows how indeed we'll have that opportunity for rain through the overnight into the morning hours. And again, Thursday afternoon. Mostly cloudy skies, turning to a good chance for showers, maybe a couple thunderstorms by Thursday evening. Haven't seen future cats that excited about rain in a long time, and it lasts on to about midnight. And then Friday, well, not quite as excited, but still the chance for rain will be there. If you want to catch the forecast, you can always do it at forward slash action for weather or on Facebook, and the tweets come out of Brian Hale, KGBT. Seven-day forecast. Looks like that chance for rain holding on through the end of the week, maybe even into early Saturday. Then next week, a cold front, you know, kind of late in the season for that, comes on down Tuesday, kicking off not only a chance for a shower or thunder shower, but also slicing quite a bit off daytime highs that will be in the low to mid 80s by that time. That's a look at your 24-7 forecast.